Hey guys, Coach Daryl back with you again today. I got some weights here, some dumbbells. I'm gonna show you guys a dumbbell piston press today. Piston press is gonna be, this is one of my favorite exercises for the shoulders. Requires dumbbells. I'm gonna stand with my feet about hip width apart. It's an overhead press. What I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna kind of front load my dumbbells. I have, I'm gonna turn to the side so you can see me. My wrists over my elbows, my palms are facing in with a neutral grip. I'm standing tall, I'm bringing my backside underneath keeping my butt engaged, keeping my stomach engaged, and I'm gonna press a weight up overhead. Notice when I drive up, I'm driving that dumbbell straight up in a straight line overhead where my bicep is close to my ear. Piston press, meaning I'm gonna do one arm, I'm gonna come all the way back down, I'm gonna get that weight to my shoulder, and then I'm gonna press up overhead. This is not a super crazy rest motion where one's coming down, the other one's firing. I want you to finish the rep as soon as it stops, the other one presses. Notice, I'm not trying to rush through the reps, okay? It's nice and controlled. Okay, now typically with this, I would not be talking during the movement. I would be breathing. Okay, so that is the dumbbell piston press. Again, it's an overhead press. I like the elbows forward and that the palms facing in. That way we can keep those lats engaged, okay, where I'm kind of squeezing my lats or squeezing my shoulder blades down and back, and I'm staying nice and tall with that throughout. Okay, I wanna keep my body in a nice straight line. This is a more of a strict style movement, meaning I'm not using a lot of hip engagement here, leg engagement, where I'm trying to dip and drive up like I would for a push press or the beginning of a jerk. Hopefully this helps you guys. If you guys have more questions on the piston press, let me know. Um, I'll talk to you guys soon.